Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this morphing animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So, first step, let's select this object 2 and let's open options and open range part 1 and go to here, make size keyframe and click this checkbox make new position keyframe and roughness keyframe then go to 20 keyframes for go to 10 keyframe use shortcut shift page down okay and let's change size like this and like this okay and move to here let's see okay and change roughness like this select keyframes make easy ease go to graph editor and select last keyframes graph make smooth like this let's see okay then back to keyframes and let's select this object to press u for see only keyframes then select this object one let's open again these contents range one and range part one again click this icon and let's go to here make size make position and make redness keyframe go to last keyframes and let's change size like this okay and move to up change size okay let's change roughness like this and move that up let's see okay good so select three frames again make easy ease. go to graph editor select this graph and make smooth graph let's see okay good and click this icon for back to keyframes. frames then again select this object one and press u for c keyframes. frames let's close object two keyframes. frames and then select these buttons these shape layers and let's select this first go to here press s click this icon make scale keyframe. frame and go to here change scale like this change zero and move to right select a frame make easy ease. let's see okay then open these options open contents range one range part one make redness shape frame go to here and change zero let's see Let's select this roughness keyframe, move to left and make keyframes easy. Let's see. Okay, good. Let's select this button one, press U for C keyframes and select this roughness keyframes. Go to graph editor, make smooth graph like this and select this scale keyframes, make like this smooth scale okay then select this roughness and scale let's control c and close select this button three control v for paste let's see nice and select this button two again control v let's see okay and button four control v nice and select this this shape layer button 5 and let's open options contents range 1 and range part 1 click this icon and in this time let's make size and make position make roughness shape frame go to here change size like this and roughness 0 change size like this 
okay and move to down okay let's move to left and make j frames easy is let's see okay let's select these j frames and move to left select these j frames move to right go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph like this okay nice then select shape frames move to left okay then select this circle let's press p go to here and make new passing shape frame go to last shape frame and move to down like this and go to 10 shape frame move to up Let's select these shape frames, make easy ease. Let's see. Okay, select these shape frames, go to graph editor and okay, let's select this shape frame, make like this. Let's see. Okay, and back to shape frames, go to here and go to 10 shape frames, select this shape frame, control C, control V. Again, go to graph editor and let's make ball animation let's see okay good and let's select this keyframe. frame move to left let's see okay good then select this last three keyframe. frame control c and control v for loop animation let's go to here press n for select work area let's see nice so in this time let's select these three frames move to right let's see okay let's move to left and go to graph editor and let's select this graph move to right okay good so close these key frames and let's see other objects okay so and let's select these objects go to here and press p make new passing key frame and go to here move to down and go to here hold shift press s make sketch key frames click this icon and go to last shape frame change scales zero select shape frames make easy let's see okay good let's select this layer move to right and this move to right okay select this last shape frames move to left okay and select all key frames go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph like this okay good so in this time let's select this object and after morphing let's change fill color open fill one and in this time make color shape frame go to here go to fill and change color to yellow and make shape frames easy let's see okay nice let's select this button 5 press u for c shape frames and let's select last passing shape frame let's move to right okay nice let's select this phone display and go to here let's change size like this and change roughness like this let's see okay good so let's select this our text and 
let's control D for duplicate, move to right and go to color, select this phone color, click OK and click here play, OK and go to window, animation composer 3, start and press it, open this text folder, animation characters and select this or this, click in and move to write this TRN for slow animation. Let's see. Nice. Let's see. Okay, very nice. Then let's select this button and let's press U. Let's close these chain frames and let's select this. Delete. Okay, and let's open options, contents, range 1, range path 1. And in this time, make size, make position, and make roughness shape frame. And let's open fill, make color shape frame. Let's press U for see only shape frames and go to here. Let's change this roughness like this and click this icon, change size for morphing this circle and move to down and move to left like this and change color to white let's see let's move to left again okay then select shape frames make easies and select this fill shape frame move to here and this move to here let's see Okay, select these shape frames, go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph. Select these last shape frames, move to like this and this. Let's see. Okay, back to shape frames, select these shape frames and move to left. Okay, good. So let's close these settings and let's create new Null object, right mouse, new and null object. For move to anchor point center, hold control and double click this palm behind icon. Okay, click selection tool. Let's select these all objects, press U for CK frames. Okay, and let's select all K frames and these K frames. Let's move to right. Okay, let's close shape frames and in this time select all these layers pair onto this null object. Select this null. Let's go to here and press P, make new position shape frame, move to down. And go to here. Let's move to up. Go to 10 shape frame, move to down. Again, go to 10 k frame, move to up. Again, go to 10 k frame, move to down. This more k frames for smooth bones effect. Let's select k frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, so let's select this play text and move to right after morphing. Okay, let's see. Let's select this last 4 k frames, right mouse keyframe interpolation change auto bezier to linear click ok let's see okay good select these keyframes move to left okay nice and go to first second hold shift press air make rotation keyframe and change rotation like this and let's move to down okay and go to here change rotation 10 go to here change minus 5 and go to again here change to that 5 and go to last shape frame change 0 select shape frames make easy let's see okay good and in this time make new position new rotation shape frame and go to here Let's move to down and go to here, move to up, again go to 5k frames, move to down. Let's see, let's select this work area, 
Okay, good. And in this time, go to here, change rotation like this. And go to here, change like this. For vibration effect. Let's see. Okay, good. So, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.